Yo, yo, what's up everybody? This is Chris from uh, chrisalta.com and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a WordPress Gravatar. Uh, if you're new to uh, WordPress and you know blogs and such and leaving comments, it's basically you know the, uh, the little default icon you're going to set up uh, so that when you do leave comments on other people's blogs, uh, you can show your face. Or you know you can put a picture of, I don't know, Finding Nemo, whatever you want to do, but uh, I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So first things first, you know, go ahead and go to trusty old Google and uh, go ahead and search Gravatar, G-R-A-V-A-T-A-R. -A -A Boom. It's going to be Gravatar.com. Go ahead and click that. See how my internet's doing. Should be good. And there we go. I think my brother might be on in the kitchen or something, but we'll see. Shouldn't be, uh, shouldn't be too, too bad. So anyways, it's uh, it's pretty simple to do. Just gonna go ahead and go to get your Gravatar today. Next thing you wanna do is go ahead and put your email in. I'm just gonna put a, just an old email I haven't used yet. Uh, it was actually something I used for, for a little niche site I was doing, so it's gonna go Apple Military, military Discounts at gmail.com. Go ahead and go sign up. And it's going to go ahead and send me a confirmation email. So what you want to do is go ahead and check your email. Go to Gmail. All right, so my email's up. And you're going to go ahead and see right here. I'm going to zoom in for you. It's going to say, Welcome to Gravatar. And then go ahead and click that. Zoom out. This is going to be a confirmation email to activate your account. So if you click on the link below, blah, blah, blah. Go ahead and give that a click. And uh, your username. So for this one, we'll just put um, example. Chris Alta. That's my username. Okay, and password. Um, we'll put um, whatever I normally put. I'm not gonna say that on the on the, on the live air though. All right, and then uh, you go ahead and check that. Should be available. I don't see why that would wouldn't be okay. And then go ahead and sign up. And then uh, I won't remember that for now. I'm not gonna use it at all. Now see, it says, "Whoops, looks like you don't have any images yet." So if you ever been on other people's blogs or or maybe even your own blog and you see that people or like your community members don't have a uh, an image, and you would really much like to see their face because you want to, you know, actually, you know, build a relationship with who, with who's actually going to, you know, be commenting on your site. Um, uh, this is what they do. They they're supposed to go ahead and you know go ahead and add one by clicking here, and uh, we'll just go ahead and uh, an image on the internet. You know, I don't. So we'll go right here and we'll just we'll just type in uh, Superman. <laughs> We're gonna be Superman. We're gonna go to go to images. And uh, uh this one looks pretty epic. Let's get the first one. And then we'll go full size image. And then uh, we should be able to just take this take this uh, URL right here, go ahead and plug it in, Let's see what happens. And there we go. Go ahead and crop this over here. We can drag that. Bring this in a bit. And that looks pretty epic right there. So we go ahead and go crop finish. And yeah, I would say it's about G. Come on, G. And there we go. So now, for example, we can go over, over and head to my website. Um, I'm already signed in, so um, we'll, uh, we'll just go to it. Anyway. Let's see, resulta.com. Here it says your name, so I'm just going to put you know, example, that's me, whatever. Uh, my, my mail, this is the email. Now, when you put your email in, it's going to read, it's going to pull that image from Gravatar. And it's gonna include it up here as it sh as it's showing right here. It's buddy Matt, and then there's me. Uh, but that's what it's gonna do. So if you go Apple, boom, uh, website. We'll just put my own again. Then right down here, just go ahead and we'll put a uh, Superman. Go ahead and zoom out. Go ahead and uh, submit comment. Now it won't pop up pop up right away because on my website I have uh, it's got to be pre-approved just because. Get a lot of spam comments, but uh, you know, so it's gonna say your comment is awaiting moderation. But you see right here, 
now it's, there's uh, your gravatar, that's your icon. So uh, I would highly recommend doing that, especially if you want to build up your personal brand. Um, yeah, it's, it, it's good to already be involved with um, with other block sites and kind of so you can be a part of the community. But if you're not showing your face, then, you know, and you're trying to get recognized, then it's going to be really hard or not harder, but it would just really help a lot if you actually just had your picture right there. So whoever's blog you're commenting on will actually recognize you and remember like, oh, that's this person. And then you never know, you know, maybe you write a post and, you know, they recognize your face, they recognize that you've been involved in the community and, you know, they want to show you some credit since you've been so kind to, uh, you know, continue to be a part of their community. So uh, uh, it can really help you grow your uh, your online business that way. And uh, overall, just uh, will help you build relationships with other bloggers who have the same common interest, but I mean that's how you do it, guys. Uh, there's really not a, a lot else to it, um, but yeah, that's it. Look at that, my internet sucks right here. Um, but yeah, guys, that's it. Um, hope you enjoy the little tutorial, and uh, talk to you soon. All right, later.